guys, it is early. It's 30 degrees out here. Woo! You can really see our breath now. Yeah, it's cool. 30 degrees. And it's not even winter yet. Anyway, we came inside because we wanted to show you guys. Can you guys see the eerie light? I don't know if you can see it. You know when it feels like dusk outside? You know when it feels like dusk outside? That's what it looks like. And I always remember this poem. Listen to this poem. If this red sky at night, because the sky was super red this morning. Red sky at night, sailors delight. It means it's going to be a really good day. Red sky in the morn, sailors be warned. So it might be a scary day, or I don't know what's going to happen weather-wise. I need to look it up. I saw but something in that house. Ooh, I it. so cool. Good morning. I saw it too. Good morning. Whew, time to go back in because pretty soon there's going to be snow at this place. Yeah, it feels eerie inside. It's the inside that kind of seems creepy, huh? Anyway, it is a PA day, which um, means there's no school in Ontario today. So we have friends over. We have friends over. I'm watching some friends of the girls and it's going to be a noisy day. Everybody who prays, pray for me because it's going to be crazy with extra kids here. So last night after we ended our vlog, we said goodnight to you guys. We ended up opening a package that we got in the mail. There was not enough room in yesterday's video to include it. So I'm going to include that footage right here and you guys are going to see that the girls got a package from a lady in Ontario named Katrina. And she had Windmills Stables Miniature Horse. So you guys can watch the footage and see what she sent to us. We got a package today in the mail. Girls are super excited. And look at the tape, it's got butterflies on it. Isn't that so cool? This package came from London, Ontario. Did you get that size? Mm -mm. I actually know somebody in London, Ontario. So do I. Oh, watch out, Toby. Because if it flames. Let's open this bad oh. baby up. <gasps> what the? I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are these for <gasps> horses? Horses. Oh my gosh. Who is this Wait, from? I have this full. I have this. Wait, I think this is her. No, I'm. No, you get that one and I'd have to get Oh my god. Suckers. Oh my god, let's look. Look at this bag, you guys. Look at this. What's that for? Oh, it's those are for saddle pads. I see saddle pads. Oh my goodness. I have no time to roll that up. Whoa. Whoa. Look at it. Oh my gosh. That is a perfect for you. It's from Fashion Horse. And look at this green one. It can, it's pink on the other side. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. White ones. Oh my God. Do you know what these are perfect for? <clears throat> Tie dye craft. Oh, I'm not gonna wreck these. Can you even believe this? Maybe <clears throat> there's pink on that other side. Oh yeah, I'm using this one I'm digging for my birthday party. That is amazing. If it fits. <clears throat> oh my god, look at this! That's so nice. And look at this! That's beautiful. Look at that. This one's for you. This is for Ziggy. Oh my gosh, this is so soft. <gasps> Saddle cover! Oh the my gosh, thing. and it matches. <clears throat> We're using this. We're definitely using that. And look at all these socks. Sucker. Little sweet treat for you all, for each of you. <clears throat> Sam, Laura, Gabby, and Sophia. Oh, they're Look beautiful. Look at the green. It's perfect for Ziggy. That would be amazing to ride with him match. on your birthday. That's incredible. Would be for blue. That's incredible, and that would, would be amazing. What in the world? What in the world? <laughs> I have to roll off this thingy now. So, so. That's beautiful, too. I know how to put these on. These are incredible. Wow. Bright, let's read who this is from. I love this. This is exactly what I wanted for us to have. Okay, um, she must have saw it and was like, yeah, I'm sure. All right, so where's this letter? I was not expecting that. Were you guys expecting that? No, not at all. I think the girls are gonna sleep with these things. Yeah, we are. <laughs> Schleich, yeah. 
And a horse tack. Let me see. Did you, you get these at Green Hawk? I don't know. Let's read the letter. No, it's from Fashion Horse. Look at these little schleich. <clears throat> I have that full. Well, now you. So I'd get that one. Instead. Yeah. So you have to have But then Abigail fits this one. It's like. Oh my god. That is just. I don't like that much right now. That's. Okay. Yeah, the I girls. Hardly even care about the schleich because they can't believe about the horse tag. Like, can you guys believe that pair. somebody would send us this? this? Okay, who's this from? And you get that. This is from Katrina. <clears throat> mommy, <clears throat> I'm getting these, mommy. I'm getting these. We'll share this and we'll share those wraps. And yeah, I got the whole entire blue set, even the wraps. We <laughs> really need a horse now. Holy moly. Oh my God. It says, Dear Day by Day Vlog, Sam, Laura, Gabby, and Sophia. Hi, my name is Katrina, and I am from London, Ontario area, so not that far from you guys. Only a few hours. I'm 24 years old, and I've been a horse lover all of my life. Although I do not ride much anymore due to finishing college and now working, but I do own, raise, show, and breed miniature horse. Recently, I was going through all my old riding horse equipment and I have found a few items that I think your curls might be able to use in your lessons and on your lease horses when you get one. I have sent a few colorful all-purpose English saddle pads and some fun colorful polo wraps for the horse's legs. Your coach may have to show you how to properly put the polo wraps on the horse, but it is always fun to have a bit of color when you ride, or at least I think so. So do we. So this one has the, that, like two each in there. So like, <clears throat> yeah, even though this is for brushes, like it's easy to hold some polo wraps Yeah, because we don't have any brushes. And right I now. know how to put them on. <laughs> yeah, you do know how? From camp. And so Guys, he's already got the sucker okay, out. I'm gonna eat it, I'm gonna test it out. It's not actually a sucker. I am going to finish reading the rest of the story. There's a whole other side and a half, and I'm loving her letter, and I'm loving her parcel. I uh, cannot believe somebody would do that for my kids. I just it, it just shocks me, and it amazes me, and thank you, Katrina, so, so much. We'll be checking out all of your links, and you'll know that we got your parcel as soon as we like your Facebook page. But thank you so much. You made their day. You made their night. Now they're eating your candy. <laughs> thank you so much. Honestly, from the bottom of my heart, that was amazing. <clears throat> All right, so now that you've seen the footage and you know what she sent to us, I'm going to show you what happened after that. This happened. The girls ended up having to, get, that comes with it. having to get their horses down out of the attic so that they could use the saddle pads. She's got the nice green one that we planned for and Ziggy. And we even put the leg wraps on, but we Yeah, they put the leg wraps on, right? Then why'd, after we took them. Why'd you take them off? Because I don't want mine to get all messed up. Before you use them on horses. Before you use them on horses. So basically, you guys are like super careful of your stuff. Yeah, but they're I using the so saddle pleasing. pads. So what's really cool is that they got this... Sophie, Gabby got this saddle pad. She got a whole set. What came with it? Um, a saddle pad, polo wraps, and a saddle cover. And a saddle cover. That is cool. And it's blue. Don't you think it would look awesome on blue? I know. Do you think Fiona will let us use it on him? Yeah. Probably if it fits. Do you want to use it on him? Yeah. I want to use this bed. And remember you guys how we planned if we got to lease Ziggy, we were going to do him green and we got a green one. It's so nice. And we got Schleich. And we got Schleich, oh, yeah. I wanted to use tie-dye and tie-dye these and let them make their own custom ones, but they like the white and they don't want to ruin them. So uh, that was super exciting. And then I was able to uh, message her on Facebook and talk to her and say thank you to her because wow, like honestly, I never in my wildest dreams would think that somebody would send us all that cool, amazing stuff. My video might go up tomorrow. Yeah, so this girl is super anxious to make her very first video, aren't you? No, I just want to open this. Yeah, she just wants to open this. So this is going to be her first video, right? Okay, let's go shoot it. All right, let's go shoot it. There's no rest for this girl. If you guys don't know, there is a new video up on her channel. It's our channel trailer. You can check it out here. I'll put the iCard. And we have another video that I edited coming out tomorrow morning, and it's all about Toby. It explains everything about Toby and how we got him, and some of you guys have been asking about why he wears a diaper. It explains it all. And don't forget also, 
Um, Gabby has a new video up on her channel. I saw 300 of you guys already checked it out and that's super awesome. But it is uh, introducing our new pet to you guys. So you wanna check that out and I'll link that here. All right, you guys, I just snuck. This is how Ruby eats her food. We're not trying to pay any attention to her because she'll stop. She knows I'm talking about her. Do, 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 do. Just walking away. But yeah, this is what she does now. I love that though because she's super casual and it, any of the little dogs, any of the little dogs just walk up and start eating out of her bowl and she's like, yeah, we can all share. That's how easy going she is. She's a good sharing girl. Okay, you guys remember we have our friends over. I'm not going to video them because I don't have permission from their parents. So I'm going to just try and cut them out. But anyway, because it's almost Halloween and we have friends over, we're going to do a super special lunch today. We are going to take our Halloween molds and make pizza pockets in these shapes. <gasps> wow. <laughs> How are we gonna do it, you ask? Well, we're gonna just try and follow the directions that I saw on Facebook, and hopefully it will turn out. So, we have some pizza dough, we have some pizza sauce, we have some pepperoni, and, and we have the cheese. So we have everything we needed to make pizza, and let's get to it. Okay, so you wanna leave it all stretched out and put it all like that. Did one, Mom. Now cut it, Mom. That's how you want it. You cut it, okay? And then you're gonna fill it up. They kinda turned out, you guys. Look at Gabby's pizza pocket black cat, the black cat, and there's a mummy. Can you please do mine now? Okay, let's do yours. So when we no. took it out of the oven, it looked like this, and then I have to do this. So there's Sophie's cat that kinda, er. Kinda didn't turn out. Mmm, it looks yummy though. <gasps> the mummy. Turned out good? Yeah, the mummies turned mm. out good. So yum. It's the day before Sylvia's birthday party and I'm just going shopping to buy all the things that I need for it, yep. I literally wait to the last second and you guys may have noticed that I'm a bit indecisive. It's hard for me to decide what I want until the very last second where I feel so much pressure that I'm like, oh, I just have to pick something. So we're headed out to get a bunch of food and- And candy a bunch of food and some treat bag stuff and whatever else we see while we're out there. Do you, do you see Sophia? I've lost her. We've lost her. We can't even find her anywhere. We're at the store and she's just gone missing. Oh, what are you guys doing? Just eating my dinner. You know where Gabby is? First you went missing and now your sister's gone missing. I don't know where she could be. <laughs> Shy girl. <laughs> And saucy girl, sassy girl. Rude girl and shy girl. All right, those are our balloons up there. I love them. I hope you don't blow away when we go outside. No, I hope you don't. Oh, I won't. You know how if you have too many balloons, you just go flying in the air? But these are only... You don't think that'll be enough? Six. These are only six. I won't blow away. Can you please hold them? We are home finally from shopping. It's dark out. It's almost 6.30 p.m. <sighs> Wish I didn't wait till the last minute, but... Let that be a lesson to you guys. Do not wait till the last minute. I got Sophie on treat bag duty. There's our balloons for tomorrow. Sophie on treat bag duty. She's got a whole basket full of um, goodies. Do you want these together with the other suckers? Uh, just, no, put them in a different pile. So she's getting everything ready. These are our treat bags. We have these kind because we want to make them look pretty on the table. Our theme Please is don't pink. Want the dogs in. I'm busy. So, so she's setting everything you up. You can't escape your duty. You can't escape your duty, Can even you though please, you're just. Mom? Can you please? Yeah, I'll let the dogs in. 
I love these things, you guys, that we found. This one's gonna be Gabby's. Oh, and right. I, if get I can get it to open. I don't know if you guys can see in there, but there's a tiny little horse, and it's a My Little Pony, I think. But it's actually really cute. It's not a My Little Pony. No, it's just a little horse. So we ordered a cake and cupcakes. What if we took these little horses out and uh, put them on everybody's cupcake? Wouldn't that be really nah. cute? Because they're so cute. I have a ton of preparation to do, to do. I'm getting fruit and stuff all ready for our table tomorrow. I don't know how it's gonna go. We're gonna go early to the barn and we're gonna set it up. I always thought it would be super fun to go to the barn and make it into a birthday party. So we're gonna get to put like placemats and her tablecloths and balloons and streamers or whatever you want and just make it look really pretty and I'm excited to bring everybody she invited to the barn and show them the horses and you know what's even more cool? I don't know if I should be telling you guys this. So um, you guys know that Katrina sent us a bunch of really cool horse stuff. Um, you've already seen the footage for that. Well, I asked Fiona and Fiona said that we can dress up the horses in our own new stuff for the birthday party, which is gonna be so super cool. I cannot wait to show you guys how that's gonna look. Also, I found a horse and I videoed this last night, but then I couldn't keep the footage in the vlog because the vlog got so long. So I saved it and I wanna show you guys right now. I'm gonna put in the footage of the perfect horse I found. Now, this horse is for sure perfect for us. I officially found the perfect horse for us. I'm gonna read it to you, okay? Okay, this is the picture. This is him. Oh my gosh, he's cute. He's so cute. Okay, so a nine-year-old, 16.1 hand, thoroughbred gelding. I know you guys all said don't get a thoroughbred or a 16.1 hand. For sale or lease, Austin was a camp horse all summer where he excelled at babysitting all his riders. He is first level dressage training and can easily jump around a course. We didn't jump him much as his riders weren't ready for anything. Uh, he is more woe than go and is very willing to do anything asked of him. The only reason we are parting with him is that he is too big for most of our riders. Come and try him. He loves to work and would excel in any lesson program or for a beginner looking for their first horse. Can go weeks without being ridden or go every day. He will still be the same horse every time you take him out. Um, this is the horse. So this is him. It's not a very good picture. He is a little tall, but everything else sounds perfect. So this is him. So I found this horse early this morning. Actually, somebody, one of you guys, um, sent me a Facebook message with this horse ad in it. So I thank you very much for that. And I went to the ad and I found it and I said, wow. And I emailed the lady right away. I already noticed that our coach already sent a PM in the comments in the comments it said her name and she sent a, a PM 48 comments on him so many people are interested in the horse I didn't even think I'd get a response back she did respond to me and she basically said that she has people coming to look at him this weekend and she'll let me know but I doubt we're gonna get him be just because so many people are interested in him so and now that you've seen the footage and you and you've seen the perfect horse for us I have a little update she took the ad down so I can't even find a picture of the horse to show you guys um, just the ones that I have on my, that I showed you on my phone. Anyway, she took the ad down, so I was like, oh man, I bet you he's gone already. I bet you, because who's gonna, like, so many people. She had to take the ad down because so many people responded. And so I messaged her, and I said, he's gone, isn't he? Isn't he? And she said, nope, he's still there. She has two people coming this weekend, and I'll let you know by Monday or Tuesday. And I'm like, we only have to get through two people, only two people. So I'm excited. <sighs> This is where prayers come in, you guys. Are you praying, Gabby? Yes. Are you praying, Sophie? Yes. Okay, you guys, I'm not gonna lie. I just went back and messaged the lady with the horse again. This is the second day I've been kind of, that we've been interested in this horse. And I'm not gonna lie, I may or may not have tried to bribe her a little bit. I don't know if that works in the equine world, but we're gonna see. Anyway, we're going to do a comment of the day. The girls are not here with me. Girls are super preoccupied. Comment of the day goes to KH Plays. And she says, oh, that was close. You almost died. Just kidding. <laughs> and it's true. I, we were all like, oh, when Sophia almost killed everybody in the barn. 
<laughs> she's like, I forgot what way. Yeah, she forgot which way. Guys. But the girls that run at our bar, kudos to them because literally uh, they were able to stop on a dime. So that was super good. And everything worked out, right, Especially Sophia? Bed. Anyway, <laughs> that is it for today, you guys. We are going to end today's video. I got the babies on my lap. Baby number I got one. Bags. Baby Wait, number two. A yeah. diaper so you could see that thing. Baby number three. And then uh, Ruby is over with Sam. He's editing today's video. So we are going to see you guys it. tomorrow. Don't forget to come back because it will be Sophia's birthday party. I can't wait to share it. I'm super excited. Are you guys excited? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. And uh, don't forget to pray that that horse is a good fit for us. And if you think that horse is a good fit for us, let us know in the comments below. I know you guys will. And give this vlog a thumbs up. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Oh, and special thank you again to Katrina for the amazing box. You're going to make um, all the difference for Sophia's birthday party tomorrow.